tell your mama that. <laughs> what's up, guys? Oh, what's up, family? It's Chris, and you're watching Bad Outside TV. Bad Outside TV. Bad Outside TV. Bad Outside TV. Hey, I got my dad with me again. Coach of all coaches. Yep, he's been saying that all day. This is going to be into the next day because it's like 12.06 right now and we're doing a video. No reaction today, guys. You know, my dad and I did videos all day today and there was a lot of comments about him. So, came up with this idea of me reading the comments to him and him giving his response. What do you guys think? Okay. I could deal with that. Yeah, I see what you mean. I was talking to them, not you. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay, so you guys are okay with it. So, we're going to go ahead and get started. But before we do, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Comment down below what you guys want to see in the next video. Hit the notification bell so you get notifications when I post. And subscribe to become a part of the family. But you know I'm not going to take care of you. Y'all should know that by now. Okay, so first... This is not really about my dad, just somebody. Oz Chopper said, surprised to see you're reviewing all hip hop. Nice vids as always. They're saying who's the he, he thinks what's the best. Then somebody commented saying that S is whack as F on one of the um cursor videos. I think it was the first one we did. Right, right, but it wasn't it was it, it wasn't whack. I mean, it was it was problems with it, but it, I've heard a lot worse. It was fine. It was fine. I mean, not like I'm gonna run out and buy it, but it wasn't it wasn't whack. Okay, thank you, Raymond. Y'all know Raymond. He my dog. He my dog. Uh, he said, well, first he said, "LOL" under one of the videos, and secondly, he said, "Thank you, Chris and Coach of All Coaches, for reacting on this video." This is Fiji's first ever gold medal in Olympics and the first for any small Pacific Island nation to win. About the dirty jerseys and the mud, I knew you might comment on it, LOL. Awesome to see your father do reactions. I love when your dad spoke Car Caribbean <laughs> accent when he heard the islands. We are from the Pacific, same island nation status, but total different region. Wow, yeah. Yeah, we're, we're, we're very happy that uh, you guys won that gold medal. I'm, I'm very proud of you guys, man. That was great. And you Keep know, every work. time something's dirty, I got to say it. So you already knew the deal. Yeah, I had no problem with the dirty jerseys. Uh, that means you're out there working. Girl, you can work and be clean. Yeah, that's called an office job. Uh, and remember <laughs> how you were saying that, why is football not a... Right, why yeah. is football not in the Olympics? So, Weed Degree said, rugby's a worldwide sport. The reason it's class in the Olympics. Okay, I could believe that. So be they're saying football is not worldwide, but rugby is. I, uh, I and that is true because I know is football true. is not worldwide. That is true because uh, every year I think it's a big deal when the NFL plays NFL Europe or something like that. They play one game uh, over in Europe and it's a big deal because football is not worldwide. That is absolutely correct. And thanks for pointing that out. Thank you. Thank you. Um, Oz Chopper also said, yeah, mushrooms are a drug. Yeah, this brother this brother was talking about mushrooms. And like <laughs> every song we listen to, I'm like... <laughs> like he was making a garden salad. So what's I was going like, on? I was like, he must be talking about drugs. Because nobody sings about or uh, raps about mushrooms. Unless it's that drug. And uh, somebody wrote in and said, yeah, is, is he talking about drugs? Okay. All right. I stand. I stand uh, substantiated. Um, Raymond also, Raymond did a lot of comments. So I'll <laughs> just say Raymond and let y'all know. He said, apprenticeship is great, but the pay is blank. $90 weekly with seven of us, we can for a two bedroom house. Oh, okay. See, I didn't get the apprentice part. I, I, t I said that. I didn't say you didn't he say that. He never it. listened. I, well, that's, that's it. That's the problem. Right. I didn't hear that part. Yeah, I mean, if if, if that's what's going on, you got you to gotta fake it till you make it. 
And uh, that's what you guys got to do. You know, I grew up uh, with uh, 10 people in one bathroom. 10, 10 people in one bathroom. And uh, sometimes you had to go outside. I mean, it is what it is. You know, but I grew up and uh, I, I got enough bathrooms for my kids and, and whatnot. So we good. Is that all? Yes. <laughs> Uh, Ravens was laughing a lot. He said, ha, 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 ha. <laughs> And he said, ha, 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 ha. Boy, it's not a secret. Speak up, boy. Yeah, yeah, because the dude was like he was whispering or something. How you rapping and you whispering, bro? <laughs> we, <laughs> we need to hear. <laughs> no, 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 I ain't got no time for that. <laughs> You got no time for, for whispering, bro. What you in a library? What you you recording in a library? <laughs> <laughs> Are you afraid you're gonna get kicked out, bro? Go go uh, get, rent your studio so you can turn the music up loud. That's all I gotta say about that. Stop whispering. <laughs> Raven Ain't also no. said. Oh, I got something else to say. Okay. Your dad is very funny. Nearly broke a rib bone from him. <laughs> Good reactions and comments are spot on, like the tries. Why is it called a try? I really don't know. I grew up hearing it, and I never thought of it until he questioned it. Well, absolutely. I got no. I got. I got no clue about rugby. I. I mean, it's some tough dudes. I mean, it's the same. It looked like the same as football without pads. And them boys from that earlier video, them boys laying each other out. And now I see why they got to change some of them rules because them boys are getting knocked out. Sure was. You know, and you and the people pay to see the stars, so I understand that. Not for guys seeing stars. <laughs> they, they <laughs> pay, That's they a good way. For the stars, way. they don't want to pay for guys seeing stars and being drug out of there. I understand that. Okay, so my dog Toby Jug, he clarified it up for us. He okay. said, the reason it's called a try goes back well over 100 years. In the very old rules, if someone got the ball over the try line of the opposition team and put it down, they could not accumulate any points from this. They would get what was known as a try at a goal. Oh, okay. To kick the ball between the posts. This is where they would be able to score points. Oh, this is wow. also where the term scoring a try in the modern game comes from. In rugby union, which this is, you get five points for getting the ball placed down over the try line, a try, and the two more points for a conversion, which is a kick at goal. The position of where the conversion is taken is dependent on where the ball is placed over the try line and another factor. Oh, wow. I didn't know that. So that's it, it's seven points like in the NFL. Yeah. Uh, when the guy put the when the guy placed the ball on the on the on the thing, okay, you gotta um that's five points, and then you gotta kick it between the uprights. I mean that is too much like football. Did did football copy them or did they copy football? I don't know. You guys, I let. That's us another know. question. <laughs> well, I remember I saw some other comments. They was like, "Oh, all these sports came from rugby or something like that." I don't know what they was talking about. Mm-hmm. Well, how, well, when did rugby start as opposed to football? Because football been around a long time. Football been around about 100 years. Anyways, Ruben Black. It's kind of the same thing the other person said, but I'm just going to shout you out real quick. Okay. said, because American football isn't a worldwide sport, but rugby is a worldwide sport. Well, where do they play it at? To, uh, write, write us back and tell us where they play rugby at. And and if you say like England and Scotland and stuff like that, that's not in the United States. Okay, so we're from the United States. So where football played, it's played in the United States. And then once a year we play it in England or somewhere like that. Or Scotland or wherever. One part one game out of the United States. You know. That's why they call it the Super Bowl and not the World Bowl. They call it the Super Bowl. Not okay, the okay, Bowl. okay, okay, okay. Okay. Somebody said, Versetti23, he said, F, don't link Aussie hip hop is effing trash apart from the underground rappers that don't believe in recording their music and only play live. I haven't even watched this, but I know it's about to be cringe worthy as <laughs> F. Well, well, you know, you want to be open-minded and give uh, stuff, a, stuff a chance to fail as well as succeed. Uh, you can, I mean, some of the greatest inventions 
in the world started off uh, as uh, a non-believers, and once you know, people will, will will surprise you. You know, so give give uh, give everything a chance. Well, not everything, you know. Give that music a chance. It, it was it was okay. Uh, like I said, I'm not running out to get it, but it wasn't horrible. You know, I've heard worse. I've heard rappers that you can't even. Uh, 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 uh. Come on, bro. What you got? Uh, uh, peanut butter in your mouth? Come on, bro. Speak up. Stop it. Two po loan says. It's because we learn how to tackle right, and believe it or not, American football are trying to teach NFL players to tackle like rugby players. You don't want to hurt them. You want to tackle them in a way where you have a chance to steal the ball. You have to use your brain. That is correct. Uh, and uh, he, He's right on both accords that they are. American football used to be about to hit. Absolutely. They want to knock you out and separate you from the ball. You guys just want to tackle and separate you from the ball. It's fine. And you're right. American football is coming around to that same thing because guys are getting their brains knocked out. And uh, they, they're going crazy once they retire. Got that, that CTE, you know, and the football getting sued. So that's the only reason why they're changing it is they're getting sued. So you're right. You're right on both accords. Pet N Z me O one. You know, every time we read his comments, it's nothing good. Okay, okay. Let's hear. Uh, um He says Han Eggers say touchdown and the effing ball doesn't even touch the effing ground. L O L. How effing stupid is that? That's not a field goal, that's a conversion. And he's right on both accords, but it's all uh, it's all on a play on words. I don't know if it was to be literal, and I never cared about what it meant either. Right, and he, he's he's being literal, uh, but it's a play on words, and we'll give him that. I thought the ball does touch the no, ground. No, the ball does not touch the ground. He's right. It doesn't have to. Oh, wait. I'm talking. I'm thinking about those things when they, like, say, they do the little replay, and like, was it really a touchdown? And they're like, the ball was right there. It touched it. And it's just like. Right, oh. but that's, no, because, okay, sometimes a guy will score a touchdown, and he'll keep running with the ball, and he'll t- take it to the equipment man and tell him, to, no, the ball doesn't have to touch the ground. He's right. It just has to cross over the the end zone, that, that little white line. Well, then I wonder why it's called a touchdown, just like he said. It's, it's it's a literal. It's it's a. I mean, if you taking it literally, uh, it's, it's basically the length of the field. Wherever you get the ball f- from, it's the length of the field to over that little white line. That's when it's called a touchdown. It's like, it's like uh, the the space shuttle landing. It's a it's a it's a it's a. It, he just touched down. Doesn't mean he just scored six points. It's a literal term. Okay, this is the last comment. Doc Gonzalez says, Dad, no one flops in rugby. The players respect the game, the rules, the referee, and their opponents too much to pull that crap on the rugby field. Okay, a lot of times, the the, the word you might look, what's his name again? Doc. Doc. A lot of times we anticipate a hit or a contact or whatever, and we brace for it a lot. It's called protecting oneself. Now, if that hit or contact doesn't happen, you may still fall. Now, you might say it's not a flop, but traditionally, that's what it's called, a flop. I wasn't saying rugby guys flop. I said that guy flopped. Now, he might have been anticipating a hard hit or even anticipating contact to himself, and he and he is called self-preservation. A lot of times, you unconsciously do it. You know, it's like if I throw a punch at her, she might react and just put her hand up. That's just not something she meant to do, but it's just a reaction. It's a self-preservation, and it's built into every one of us. Okay. 
this is the end of the video guys thank you for commenting and letting us read your comments don't forget to like comment subscribe and share comment down below what you guys want to see next my social media is down in the description hit the notification bell to get notification when i upload and hit the subscribe button to join the chant to join the family but you know i'm not gonna take care of you